So today our topic is cyanosis. The term cyanosis means blueness of the skin and it causes it excessive amount of deoxygenated hemoglobin in the skin, blood vessels, especially capillaries. The deoxygenated hemoglobin has an intense dark blue purple color that is transmitted through the skin. In general, definite cyanosis appear whenever the arterial blood contains more than 5 gram of deoxygenated hemoglobin in each 100 milliliter of blood. Cyanosis seen in polythemia, not in anemia. Person with anemia almost never becomes cyanotic because there is not enough hemoglobin for 5 grams to be deoxygenated in 100 milliliters of arterial blood. In a person with excess RBCs as occur in polythemia, vera the great excess of available hemoglobin that can become deoxygenated led frequently to cyanosis. In hypoxic hypoxia, less arterial pressure of oxygen, so more reduced hemoglobin and when it exceeded more than 5 grams, cyanosis developed. In stagnant hypoxia, due to slow blood flow, more oxygen extracted from blood, so more reduced hemoglobin, so chances of cyanosis. In histotoxic hypoxia, no oxygen used, no reduced hemoglobin produced, so no cyanosis. Local factors like exposure to mild cold 20 degree cause cyanosis. This is due to the cutaneous vasoconstriction of both arteries and veins. So less blood flow and stagnant hypoxic like addition. Exposure to severe cold no cyanosis because O2 hemoglobin curve shift to left with prevent release of O2 from HB end. O2 consumption of tissue reduced markedly as there is a reduced metabolism. Amount of reduced hemoglobin is less and so no cyanosis. Sites for cyanosis areas of thin skin, mucous membrane of undersurface of tongue, lips, ear lobes, nail beds, tip of nose. Types of cyanosis. There are two types of cyanosis central cyanosis and peripheral cyanosis. In central cyanosis, it is due to the hypoxic, hypoxia, and all its cause. Peripheral cyanosis, it is due to the stagnant hypoxia and all its cause. Feature of central cyanosis extremities are warm and blue due to hyperdynamic circulation and HD. Cyanosis on tip of nose, lips, and the tongue. Features of peripheral cyanosis extremities are cold and blue due to less blood flow and vasoconstriction of vessels. Cyanosis on nail beds.